There are approximately $26 billion worth of new CLOs issued in the first quarter of 2013. This follows about $55 billion worth of CLOs issued in all of 2012. However, Fitch doesn't see that issuance pace being sustainable, as many of the CLOs originally scheduled for the second quarter of 2013 were pulled into the first quarter. This was done in advance of the new FDIC assessment rules that went into effect April 1st. Total CLO issuance is still projected to be between $55 and $75 billion by most market participants. The biggest challenge facing CLO managers in the current market is identifying and sourcing collateral that works well within the CLO structure in this current market. The supply and demand dynamics also impact a CLO manager's credit selection abilities in another way. When loan demand outstrips supply, loan issuers get more friendly terms. We've seen that evidenced by the large increase in covenant light loan issuance through the first quarter of 2013. Most CLOs will have a limitation on covenant light loans allowed in their portfolio to about 40 to 60 percent of their overall investments. With the total loan market now at about 40 percent deemed covenant light, it's reasonable to assume that some managers will actually find this constraint a limiting factor in their credit selection going forward. The outlook for senior CLO tranches remains stable. The activity we're seeing in the underlying leveraged loan market is very typical of the early stages of a corporate credit cycle, which was factored into our analysis when we assigned our initial CLO ratings.